So this is the SEC conference uh, explained right now what what could happen or what could not happen. Um, so for multiple teams have a tie. I really wish I didn't write this on cardboard. Never mind, it it focused out. We're gonna start with Alabama here. We have Ole Miss versus Alabama. Currently, Ole Miss is winning thirty-seven to twenty-three. Last time I checked, now they could be winning. Um, then Alabama plays Tennessee, I think, at their home. So it's going to be a tough game. Um, if Ole Miss wins, I'm going to want Tennessee uh, Tennessee to lose because they beat Auburn after 10 minutes of us leading by 8 points. Congratulations. You'll play just hell. Florida, uh, that's going to be probably an easy win for Florida. Or uh, for Alabama, I'm not going to lie. But prove me wrong, Florida. And then you have Arkansas. That should be an easy win, I'm not going to lie. Then have Auburn, who can go 12-6, and six, which is going to knock them, or sorry, 13-5, if they win the, uh, the next three games. Uh, Mississippi State, which is a home game. Missouri and Georgia, which are away games for Auburn. They came into Tennessee with the energy. They had an eight-point lead with at like with ten minutes left on the clock, and then they gave up their eight-point lead, which is sad. And then we have Kentucky, uh, Arkansas should be an easy one, twelve and five, or sorry, at uh, eleven and five. And then have Vandy, that's going to be twelve and five. And then Tennessee, they could either win that game or lose it, which will either give them 12 and 6 or 13 and 5. Uh, either way, they'll be tied with the conference if they get 13 and 5, sinking with Auburn if they do that. Um, is that Kentucky? That was. Oh, we got Florida. They're playing at South Carolina for their first game. 10 and 5 right now. And they beat Mizzou. Which I feel bad for them. I kind of wanted Mizzou to win. I like Mizzou. Even though I like Auburn. Um, they're 10-5 and five now. Florida at South Carolina. They they ought to show up to play. Same thing with Alabama. If they don't, they'll be 10-7. and seven, And if they beat Vanderbilt, they'll be 11-7. If they win South Carolina and Alabama and that, they'll be 13-5. and five. Tied for conference. We now have South Carolina. They play Florida home and Tennessee home. I don't know who I want to win, uh, honestly. Uh, I'd, I'd have to do a bunch of calculations to decide on who I would want to win. And determining if we get the conference. So it's either going to be two games out or one game out before I can say... If this team doesn't do something, they're going to lose and not be in the conference. Um, but Florida, home game, and Tennessee home game. Like I said, Florida, probably after this week here, so going into Tennessee on Wednesday of March, whatever March, like 3-5 or something like that, or 3-6, I think, oof. Three slash six. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. And then they play Miss State. And they play at Miss State, which could be a good game. They did play Kentucky really well. Good job, Kentucky. Keep it up. Keep playing the same energy that you just did. Wait, did I say Kentucky? Or did I? Uh, I meant Miss, Miss State. Miss State, keep up the energy. That was really good. Um... Oh, just don't don't do it with us. All right, let us win that. <laughs> Actually, I guess it doesn't really matter if they win. If they win, then I guess they'll move. They'll kick us out of the conference title and move them up one, maybe even up against us. Now we have Tennessee. We have Alabama. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention they're ten and four, right? Yeah, 10 and 4. Are they playing four games? Maybe not. 
It might be 11 and 4. I think they might be 11 and 4. And I wrote that wrong. I'm gonna quickly rewrite that. So they might be 11 and 4. Um, 12 and 3, Tennessee. Ooh, Ryan. Hate that we lost to them. We had an 8 point lead with 10, 10 minutes left. We have uh, Alabama. Don't know where they're playing at. That's going to be a good game. Or, as I broke down, let me find it. Tennessee or Alabama. Good game or blowout. Same thing with, uh, okay, well, this is what I originally was going to show. Auburn at Tennessee. I didn't know that that was a good game. Ole Miss at, Al uh, sorry, Alabama at Ole Miss. Close game, or if Alabama showed up, they would blow out. Same thing with Auburn. Well, not really Auburn, but Mississippi State at Auburn. I don't know. They might show up with the same energy that they showed up with Kentucky and nearly win. Hopefully they don't, and we can win to keep us in the conference title. If not, then our season would be over. Other than that, we would be able to do March Madness. Um, back to this. <laughs> so either this is going to be a good game or a blowout. I think they're playing at Tennessee. So Alabama. I don't know. I honestly don't know. If you lose, then you better show up and play Tennessee right. South Carolina. That's going to be another game that I don't know. South Carolina loses to Florida. Then I would want South Carolina to win. And then that would give us a tie. All four teams a tie. So I'd give South Carolina, Florida, Alabama, and Auburn a tie for the conference. And uh, Tennessee, they'd have to lose almost every game. Alabama and South Carolina, they need to show up and play. Same thing with Kentucky. Y'all got to show up and play. If y'all can knock Tennessee off and make them a 12-16, and 16, that would be really well. would look really well for your, uh, for your school. But... Y'all, Alabama, y'all got to win. Y'all lose to Ole Miss, y'all got to win. Same thing with South Carolina. If they lose to, who are they playing? Florida, Florida. Y'all beat South Carolina, and y'all win. Then, well, actually, hold on. Like I said, I'd have to do the math. So, Alabama, lose to Ole Miss. Beat Tennessee. Uh, Florida, if you win your next two games, shoot. Yeah, see, that's going to that's gonna be in the second video. I'm going to have to do some math. So, yeah, I'll be right back. Here's your current standings, and they are... Oh, they're actually 10 and 4. Wait, no. Hold on, what? South Carolina's 10 and 4. That's right. Alabama's 11 and 2. That's right. All right, yeah. Bye.